Good afternoon, everybody. Um, we're here at Submit the Quarantine. I believe we're all ready to episode four this week. Um, this week, we're going to be focusing on having a little bit more fun. Um, we did a little bit more drilling. We did some training throughout the week that we didn't record. But um, our focus today is we're going to be using um, different obstacles that you can find in the house to kind of simulate a little bit more anticipation in your kids, especially for them grappling and moving around. Um, the technique is a huge, huge aspect of jujitsu, but then there's also the feeling and the rhythm and the timing. And so we're gonna be working a lot on that timing. And that's what I'm talking about with anticipation. Kind of anticipating when, it, when to do a move, when not, so they can kind of take the training wheels off and not be going so, have everything be so predictable and easy. Okay, so hopefully you'll see a little bit more mobility if you guys are doing this at home. And it's just fun, so you guys are gonna see a lot of movement for the guys. Only a few exercises though. We're only gonna do just a few partner drills with this, but um, you can really combine them in a lot of ways if you see fit to kind of help sure, make sure they get good exercise at home, okay? So let's get y'all started. Okay, you guys, we're gonna do our, our calisthenics first. We're gonna open up with some jumping jacks and some push-ups just to get warm, and then we're gonna get right into our series of drills, okay? Um, let's first do our jumping jacks, okay? Let's, let's, how many do you want to do? How many do you want to do? Okay, 50 it is. 25, 25. All right, you count 25, you count 25. Ready? Okay, go. One, two, Faster. three, four, five, six, Move, move like just head movement. Um, Stagger stance, bend your knees, back flat. All I want you to do, and you can even anticipate with a hand to block the hand, but I want you to change levels and curl from side to side. Okay, good. Okay, that's gonna be one. For that signal, I'm gonna say duck. Okay, duck. But let's see a good stance, you know, pivot through. Okay, Se second one out. We're gonna make sure we curl our, our rear back and just kind of like splay the shoulders forward. Okay, good. What are we gonna call that one? Um, push. What? Curl up. Curl up. Push. Give me something better. Um, hmm. Push back. Something a little bit easier to say. So I'm gonna say duck. I'm gonna say bump. 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 Okay. And number three is going to be a square sprawl. Okay. Sprawl and hips down. Come back up. There you go. Let's do your square sprawl. Sag your ass so you guys don't hit heads, please. Okay. And then the last one is we go to the floor and we switch our hips like we're doing a guard pass. Okay. Like this. Come back. Okay. You can go to either side. Let's see it, guys. Hip switch. And I'll call that one switch. Okay, we'll say switch. All right, let's warm you guys up. Stand up. Hip switch. Bump. Bump. Sprawl. Duck. Duck. Sprawl. Hip switch. Hip switch the other side. Hip switch the other side. Stand up. Duck. 
Так. 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 Бам. 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 Эсвек. Спрал. Спрал. Так. 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 Бам. Walk, walk, move around, move around, move around. Bump. <laughs> move around, move around, move around. Duck. Move around, move around. Bump. <laughs> move around, move around. Hip switch. Move around, move around. Duck. Right, that was a bad duck, Ollie. Let's go. Duck. Hip switch. Bump. <laughs> All right, good job, boys. You guys feel warm as yet? Yeah. Okay, we're gonna get you guys started. All right, you guys, um, we've got my belt right here, and we're gonna be just working on some different drills. Um, I'm not gonna be swinging super hard with this. I don't, again, try not to hurt anybody. I just want them to keep moving. Um, we're gonna use the same first three exercises, but now we're gonna use the belt to simulate when to do it, okay? Um, I'll come over here with the real quick. Please. Okay, so when I do a nice sloping swing, I'm gonna kind of predict, I'm gonna leave my palm upwards so he's gonna know he's gonna get up high. He's gonna go duck right underneath, boom. When I grab the two knots, and I'm gonna throw it in his belly, that's when he's gonna bump his hips out, right? Now when my wrist is down and I'm swinging low, he's gonna sprawl underneath it, okay? I'm gonna go on both sides. And get him used to it on both sides. I'm not really trying to trick him yet. I'm, if I do one side, I'm going to go to the same side on the return, okay? Once he gets more comfortable, then I can start mixing it up and playing with it, okay? Should we get going, you guys? Yeah. All right, let's do it. All right, who wants to go first? Mine, okay. Let's put about three minutes on the clock for each kid, and let's have some fun, okay? There we go, one more, one more. Keep going. Up. There we go, again, again. Oh, 
Everybody gets dirty. Everybody gets dirty. Thank you. 
shove it through it. Like, just kind of proud. Like, just like, yeah.
about Mohawk this morning. He's not in general a little Mohawk kid, but because of the circumstances.
for two skate vlogs, two armor